In this demo, we're going to show you how to terminate electrical wires that you're no longer using. The goal is to cap the ends with wire nuts and enclose the wire safely inside a junction box. You'll do this if you're disconnecting a light fixture, another device, or if you're taking something out of service. You only need a few tools for this. A wire stripper, a screwdriver, a utility knife, a voltage tester, electrical tape, and wire nuts. These wires are hot, so we can't touch them. Before working with exposed wires, always turn the power off at the breaker box. Now, let's test all the wires again with the non-contact voltage tester. Okay, nothing is hot, so it's safe to proceed. If there isn't a junction box where you're terminating the wires, or if you're moving the box, you have to install one. A plastic box usually has internal tabs or clamps for securing the electrical cables. You can also add separate clamps if necessary. A metal box should have a ground wire and may or may not have internal clamps. If you need to add a clamp, remove a knockout plug and install a clamp into the hole. With any box, make sure it's securely mounted to your stud using these screw holes. And use an old work plastic box if your wall or ceiling is drywalled. Now it's time to trim the wires and clean them up. Cut off any twisted or damaged bare ends, then use a wire stripper to remove about half an inch of the plastic insulation. Now, twist on a plastic wire nut to cap each wire. Use the appropriate size wire nut to cap your wire. The smallest nuts in most standard variety packs work best for 14 gauge and 12 gauge wire. Turn the wire nut clockwise as tight as you can get it by hand. Once the wires are capped, wrap electrical tape around each cap and wire as an added safety measure to prevent the cap from falling off. All that's left is to fold the wires and push them into the box. Make sure the nuts don't come loose here. To finish the job, install a blank cover and tighten the screws. It's important to keep this box accessible, so don't cover it with drywall, wallpaper, or paneling. Now it's safe to restore the power to the circuit. The wires you capped will still be energized, but they're safely contained and terminated inside the box.